In this presentation, we're going to turn on the projects feature, which will help us to do our job cost and process within the Zero software. Time to go with Zero. Here we are in our job costing company dashboard. So we're going to turn on the projects now. Unfortunately, I already turned on the projects because I got a little excited and started to move forward without you guys. But if we can get there, it's easy to get there. So I'll show you how it's done over here. We got the drop down. We're going to have the drop down up top. Just note here that within the drop down, you can start different company files. So if you were to go back and forth between, say, the demo file, the one they give you that you could go in and, and check out and the current one that we have set up, which is the job cost and company. You can go back and forth between those and you can even set up other companies to practice with in within your your free trial, which is a great tool. So if you hadn't already set up the projects, there would be something down here in the drop down that would say projects and then and then you'd go into that and then it would say uh, you want to turn on projects and you're going to say yes, turn on the projects. And then once the projects are turned on, if you go back to the dashboard, you will then see a projects tab. So once turned on, you'll have a projects tab when you are looking at the dashboard. Then if you were to click on the projects tab, you have your options in the drop down, all projects, time entry, staff and staff call. I'm going to go to all projects. So we're going to go into the all projects, which is really kind of like, uh, you know, the normal page, the home page uh, kind of activity within the projects. And then you've got this page with the in progress. So we have drafts in progress and then the closed projects. That's how we're going to be sorting uh, this information. So that's how you're going to turn on the projects. It's going to be one of the major tools that we'll use in order to track this information in a, in a job costing type of format. So that's going to be it for now. Let's get out of here.